it's Anna from Cornerstone Auto, and today I'm going to be showing you the 2016 Dodge Charger SRT Hellcat. The Hellcat is the fastest and most powerful sedan in the world. Uh, fun to drive is definitely an understatement on this vehicle. You have 707 horsepower, 650 pound-feet of torque, and you can go 0 to 60 in 3.4 seconds take a look under the hood here. As you can see, we have the SRT supercharged Hemi V8 engine. Um, if the V8 is going to be a little bit much for you, we can definitely do some different configurations. Taking a look at the front grille, as you can see, we have a really nice aggressive look. Over on the left-hand side is the SRT badge. We also have daytime running HID headlamps there as well. Um, this color that we're looking at today is called pitch black, uh, but we can do many different color options. If you want to get pretty crazy with orange and purple, we can definitely do that. Or you can just stay with the black and stay a little more subdued under the radar. Um, here we also have the Hellcat badge there. All right, let's take a look in the passenger side here. On the door, you can see we have really nice detail with the leather stitching. We do have a Harman Kardon sound system in this vehicle. The seats are really nice and comfortable. They really hug you while you're driving around. Um, leather stitching, again, with the white stitching. We have the SRT badge there on the back seat. These seats are also heated and cooled. Also power adjustable with lumbar support as well. Really nice and comfortable. Taking a look in the back seat, we have uh, bench style seating for the passengers in the back. Again, leather seats and their heated outboard seats there. We have the heated seat buttons in the center console there, along with USB ports as well. Um, really nice amount of leg room there for your passengers in the back. And we do have a 60-40 split. And then just fold down that back seat for access to the trunk and fit some of those long items. All right, let's make our way to the back of the vehicle. I do want to point out the Dodge Signature taillights. We do also have a rear view backup camera there parking sensors below and then there's a little button over here to open up the trunk or you can just hit this button here on the uh, key fob I'll go ahead and open up for you as well nice amount of storage room in the Hellcat makes it really nice and functional as well all right let's move over to the wheels here here we have the SRT 20 inch black matte wheels they look really nice we also have Brembo brakes in there with the red painted calipers and some really nice Pirelli tires on there as well. And then here's another look at the back seat here. Again, really nice leg room. So it's a really nice sports car that fits the whole family. And then moving up to the driver's side, we do have blind spot detection here on the mirror. Um, and then this key is equipped with keyless go. So if you have the key in your purse or in your pocket within three feet of the vehicle, and you go to open the handle, the door will automatically unlock for you. So that's a really nice feature. Also, you may notice that I have the red key here. So when you buy the Hellcat, you're going to be getting two different keys. You have the red key, and then you also have the black key. The red key is going to unleash the 707 horsepower, and then the black key um, will limit it to only 500 horsepower. There's also a valet mode. Um, so if you're going to be giving it to the valet and you don't want them to go crazy with it, you can. Um, Switch into valet mode and you only get 300 horsepower there. All right, let's take a look in the driver's side. We have memory seats for up to two drivers there. Again, the really nice, comfortable, uh, heated and cooled seats uh, that really hug you nicely while you're driving around. Again, power adjustable seats there with lumbar support as well. All right, guys, here we are on the interior of the 2016 Dodge Charger SRT Hellcat. Uh, above it, we do have a really nice sunroof up there. And then as you can see, we have uh, garage doors that we can program here for up to three different garage doors. We do also have an auto dimming rear view mirror here with your 911 assist buttons there. Below that, we have your seven inch Uconnect screen. Um, right here, let's actually start on the radio. We've got your radio screen, You've got your media device. You can connect your media devices via USB auxiliary or Bluetooth. Um, and then we have your control panel where you can turn on your heated seats, your vented seats, your heated steering wheel as well. We also do have uh, dual zone climate controls here. Um, and then you can pair your phone as well if you'd like to do that. We do also have a really nice app screen here. So we have different apps. Again, you can control your heated seats here, your ventilated seats. We do also have iHeartRadio. 
Um, we do have a navigation, Pandora radio, and then on the next screen we do also have a Wi-Fi hotspot. But I do want to go back to the first page on the app screen, and as you can see here we have a drive modes button. So this comes in really handy when you want to take this um, to different driving terrains or if you want to take this to the track as well. So we do have a track mode, we have a sport mode here, um, and then we have a custom mode where you can customize however you want to drive and then we also have a default mode. Also below we have some racing options, your valet mode, and then we do also have an eco mode as well. We also have an SRT pages, performance pages um, screen. So here's the home page, got different pictures of the vehicle. We also um, have different timers, so if you want to take this thing out on the track, we can uh, do your 0 to 60 timer, all, all the different timers on here, your last, your best, all that stuff. We also have a ton of different gauges for you to look at, so your oil temp, uh, transmission temperature, battery. We also have your boost pressure, intake air temp, a lot of good information on that. We also have a G-Force screen as well. And then we have your engine screen, so you actually can see real-time horsepower and torque and stuff like that on there. So that's a really cool thing, too. Okay, below that, we have different hard buttons for the uh, radio. We also have a launch button here. So this is a safety feature that when you're taking off, it definitely um, just helps keep the vehicle in a nice straight line, keeps it from drifting back and forth. Uh, you can also turn off your traction control if you wish, and you can also turn off your parking sensors in the back there. And then below that, again, hard buttons for your dual zone climate controls. Uh, we do have an automatic transmission in this vehicle. You can flip it into sport mode if you'd like, and then, then there are some paddle shifters up on the steering wheel. Um, but we do have a manual transmission available on this one as well. And then in the center console here, we have USB port, auxiliary port, and an SD card reader as well. And then coming up to the steering wheel on the right-hand side, we have your cruise control settings. On the left-hand side, as you can see, we have Bluetooth and voice control as well. And then up on the dashboard, we have your driver information system. Uh, so this is another place that has a really a lot of good, helpful information on it. So right now we just have it on the digital speedometer, but you can scroll through and look at different vehicle information. Here's your tire pressure, your coolant temperature, transmission temperature. And then as you keep scrolling down, you can see another performance screen here. This also has your 0 to 60 timer on it. And then your fuel economy, uh, different trip information, audio information, any stored mes messages you have. We also have a speed warning screen here and diagnostics as well. So again, today I showed you the um, Dodge Charger SRT Hellcat. So if the Hellcat is going to be a bit much for you, we can definitely accommodate you with um, different trim levels, different configurations for the engine and stuff like that. So do feel free to give us a call or just stop on in and see us. Um, our number is 763-441-2300. And then also you can find us online at cornerstoneauto.com.